Hey everybody, in this video we are going to quickly show you how to apply materials to individual or multiple faces on your mesh. Okay, fairly easy. First thing you're going to notice here, when you have your object and you go to the materials tab, most meshes will by default have the ugly gray material assigned to them. So what we want to do is let's make a new material that I can apply to one or more of the faces. So I'll click the plus sign and I make a new material slot. It's empty. So I make a new one to fill that slot. It's called Material 1. Now I can pick a color for it, uh, just to make something obvious, like yellow. Okay, I make it super bright. Okay, now I have yellow. Now to assign this, it's really easy. In Edit Mode, just go to Face Select, select a face or two, and click Assign. But when you click the Assign button, I don't see anything happening, notice my selection had jumped back onto the gray. That's because when I selected these faces, these faces were gray material, so it jumps to the material of the face you select. So just I want a new color there, click the yellow, now click Assign. And you can see they do turn yellow. It may not look exactly like the yellow that you've done here, and that's because of the lighting in the world. If I had some more lights, this would look like that yellow or something like it. Now let's say you want to add some more colors on there. You could go plus sign, fill it with a new material. Let's pick a new one there. I'll go for the purple. Let's pick a face or two, or three or four. Notice it's jumped back to gray, because the faces I was clicking on were gray material. And go back to purple and click assign. And they turn purple. And that's the basics, right? Whatever face you click on selects the material in your material slot, right? Showing you what material you've put on top of it. Uh, just to quickly show you what the select and deselect do, whatever color you have here, if I go deselect, it deselects all faces that have that material purple. If I go yellow, select, it selects them. Okay, deselect them. Purple, select, deselect. This can be useful later on when you have lots of faces with a certain material, and maybe you want to change it or do something. You can just go, hey, all the yellow stuff, yellow, select. And now I've got all the yellow automatically selected for you. Anyways, that's basically it. You'll see in rendered mode, it's colored it. This sort of looks ugly, not too great, but it is the start to coloring objects, uh, individual faces, and it's the start also to put pictures on it, which is going to be the next thing. How do you put like images or pictures onto the faces? Okay, so that'll be the next video.